The Nebraska legislature advanced a bill today that would allow Nebraskans to carry a concealed handgun without obtaining a permit or training. The debate grew personal and tumultuous and was even halted for a brief time. 3 News Now reporter John Kipper is live in the newsroom to explain how the debate went off the rails, Kip. Yeah, Mary, frustration boiled into anger at the Nebraska Capitol Friday during a debate over a constitutional carry bill. Now, it started Thursday when Senator Michaela Kavanaugh said she feared that people in the balcony of the legislative chamber supporting the bill may have concealed weapons. In response, bill sponsor Senator Tom Brewer said if you can't deal with who's in the balcony, then you shouldn't be in the unicameral and told her to do a gut check. That is Friday, she reacted, saying her priority is going home to her children. And to be mocked for my commitment to my children as though I'm not fit to be in this legislature is beyond disheartening. It's not the first time Senator Brewer has insulted me as a mother in this legislature. It is clear that he doesn't think that mothers are fit to serve in the legislature. This later led to a defensive brewer by Senator Julie Slama. I, I, some people, when I said that I was going to respond, told me to just let her stomp her feet and whine like a toddler, and eventually she'll just wear herself out and take a nap. Slama referenced Brewer's two Purple Heart medals from War in the Middle East, and it turned into a bit of chaos on the floor. That man has sacrificed more for this country than anything Senator Michaela Kavanaugh could even begin to wrap her head around. Point of order. Senator Kavanaugh's claims that Brewer said mom shouldn't be in the legislature is false. And it, can I get a gavel, please, Mr. Speaker? Soon the unicameral stopped debate, voted on whether to even continue for the rest of the day, and then largely voted to move on. But not before a long time, Senator Steve Lathrop admonished the body, saying personal tax have gone on too long. What we've let this thing devolve into, devolve into, on our watch, on our watch, that is not acceptable. Lathrop, who declined to run for a second term in his second stint in the legislature, said the lying and theatrics have just become too much. Everything's decided before I get to the floor. This is choreographed. Somebody's got a vote card. Everybody knows what's going to happen on every bill. And then people stand up and say things that are personal attacks. Other senators like Patty Panzing Brooks said the chair of the body should have stopped Slama from attacking Kavanaugh. And as a mom, I would have sent everybody to their rooms until everybody can get back together and be kinder to one another. Now, after all this, just enough senators voted in favor of the bill for it to go through. And then three more senators changed their previous votes to yes to make the total to the larger margin of 36 votes. Reporting in the newsroom, John Kipper, 3 News Now.